everything in the tail of the tape papers there. Pinoy na tubong Cagayan de Oro, nagpasikat sa undercard ni Manny Pacquiao. Kalaban hindi nakabangon sa isang matinding uppercut. Pero bago natin simulan ang kanilang laban, ayatin muna ang kilalanin ng dalawang fighter. Taong 2012, nang pasukin ng pro-boxing ng tubong Cagayan de Oro na si Harmonito de la Torre at matapos itong magtala ng sampung magkakasunod ng panalo sa Pinas taong 2013 ay nabigyan ng pagkakataon ng Pinoy para ipakita ang husay sa labas ng ating bansa at dito na nga niya nakaharap ang Indonesian boxer na si Jason Butar Butar na sa laban ito ay magkahalong saya at kaba ang pakaramdam ni De La Torre sapagkat bukod sa ito ang unang laban ng ating kababayan sa labas ng ating bansa ay undercard din ang labang ito sa laban ng Manny Pacquiao vs. Brandon Reyes samantala Ginanap naman ang kanilang mismong laban sa Kotay Arena ng Macau, China na kung saan may ring record ang Indonesian na labing anim na panalo, labing dalawa rito ay tinapos sa knockout, may labing isang talo at isang draw. Habang sa ating kababayan naman ay sampung panalo, lima dito ay galing sa knockout at wala pa nga itong talo. Halin at silipin natin kung paano nagpasikat ang ating kababayan bilang isang dayo. in the black trunks with the white trim. He's taller, he's heavier, he's younger at 19, and he has a three and a half inch advantage in reach, and he's tough. So far, everything going his way. Buddha Buddha from uh, Indonesia, because his idol is Chris John, the 12 year, but he's not in the league with it. Remember the name, Harmoto de la Torre, General Santos. Just underway here at the Kotai Arena. A beautiful, beautiful setting here. The Venetian Hotel in Macau. Larry Merchant will be around in a while. And we'll have full coverage for you throughout the course of the evening. So, we'll run away. Again in the black trunks. Harmonito de la Torre. Yeah, he loves to run in the high mountains of General Santos City. Had a good amateur background, as I mentioned, with those 47 victories and all those knockouts. A very good boxer with plenty of power. And he's usually in a great place. You see him bouncing around. Rick! Decent deep. That's Dan Rex is the third man. Buddha Buddha just sets up right in front of him, and it's just a matter of time before De La Torre lets go with the right. And there it was. Didn't quite catch him. Elatori undefeated, ten and zero with five knockouts. You get the now he sets up. I don't like when he sets up and doesn't do anything. You set up in front. And that time he does. Nice left hook, body shots now. Those took their toll. Now you hit. Back. Closing seconds now of the first of six rounds here at this beautiful Gotai Arena. It's Sunday morning here and it's early. So again, the setting, this beautiful Gotai Arena. Sheldon Adelson has been here. here. You're watching TopRank.com as we stream for you, leading up to the big fights later on this evening. What a fight card you get! This is really extraordinary stuff. Kinds of features on our fighters throughout the course of the evening, and we're going to be showing you some of those features. But you know, if you want to see the whole feature, you can go to Top Rank Fight Time. Right now, I'm sure you want to watch the fights, but uh, we'll have plenty of feeding up to our big fight between Brandon Rios and, of course, Manny Pacquiao. However, the Billy Dibs, if Jenny was uh, fight of the year a couple of years ago when they fought the first time, so don't be surprised a lot of fireworks in that one as well. But right now we get a couple of youngsters in there. Guy by the name of Jason Buddha Buddha, a 15, 11, and one with 11 knockouts. 
Right. Nice looping right hand by De La Torre. De La Torre trying to really get things going here. Right. Wonderful job with this fighter. He's one of the good friendly promoters down in Melbourne. I'm on the air down there quite a bit, so I'd say hello to KB and of course so my farmer. They call him Bernie the Attorney down there. He's in the local Rick. boys. Rick. But uh, Buddha Buddha doesn't seem to be coming back from well with any money. Rick. So they missed misses again. Surround so leads to his territory. Almost everything he hits is with authority. Hey. Closing seconds down. This is the second round of scheduled six round affair. Kotai Arena. There he did with a decent shot. Follows up with a hard body shot. And it goes into the. Here we go with round number three. In the black trunks, of course, is De La Torre. He looks like he wants to pick it up. That's a slip. Stop. Much. You notice that um, everything on the he's taller, he's heavier, and now they're saying, "Yeah, when's he gonna start the knockdown?" All right, the count's up to four, five. I think he's gonna get up six and seven. He's out. Nine. Oh, it's all. Sa third round ng kanilang laban, bagamat bahagi ang nahawi ng ating kababayan ng Indonesian, ay hinatulan pa rin ito ng referee bilang isang knockdown. Pero bago man ito tuluyang matumba, ay isang solid na uppercut na tumama dito. Kaya naman sa pagkakatumba nito ay hindi na nito nagawa pang bumangon para lumaban. Hanggang dito na lamang po tayo. At kung nagustuhan mo naman ang ating video ay huwag kalimutang mag-like and subscribe na din para manotipay ka sa ating susunod na upload.